Hello YouTube friends, welcome to Maria's Miscellany, where in this video I have a little haul for you. We stopped by the thrift store today and um, I did pick up one bag which um, had some really cool items um, I thought were worth the $3.99. And then I have a bag here of stuff that my mom gave me when I went over to, <laughs> to her house. Okay, but let me start with the thrifted bag. Um, I did pick up a book. This is, let me move this over because there's not a lot of room, A Little Princess. And I actually want to read this book, but I loved the, the dust jacket. And look at this. The actual book cover is gorgeous. Look at that little flower. I love the color. I love the image. Look at the end papers. It's like so beautiful. So I definitely want to, um, I want to read it actually. I, I've seen the movie with Shirley Temple. But I kind of always wanted to read the book. So I'm going to do that. And then when I'm done, it's got some kind of neat uh, illustrations in here as well. Look at that. How cute. They're, uh, oh, they're a color. It's just kind of very muted colors. So pretty. So I don't know if I'm going to turn this into um, an altered book. Or more than likely, I'll just make a junk journal out of it. Uh yeah, but I just, I love that. And this was only a dollar for this book. So I love it. I mean, it's not old or anything. It's, uh, I just liked it. This is what sold me definitely the, the cover. <laughs> All right. So that's the one a book I picked up. I've been trying not to bring too many books home. Okay. Um, then I picked up this bag. It was $3.99. And uh, what made me get it is I saw there was a lot of glue sticks in here. And these are the really long glue sticks. Um, and I am running low on my glue sticks. And my glue gun is that big one like that. So I thought for the glue sticks alone, it would be uh, worth the $4. But I also saw that there were um, some, not this, but actually this was on top, the some page protectors. And I thought, oh, those are always handy but i'm a i didn't notice these are extra capacity page protectors so let me move this aside for a second and show you one thing at a time um this was also in there but check these out they are like little bags almost there's five of them but they have these little uh, gussets or what have you down here so that you can actually put like a stack of papers in here so I totally love this and they're very sturdy. And um, so what I want to do is I have some papers like just up here kind of stacked up there that I would rather put in a, in a binder. Um, and but, you know, there's a stack of them. Like maybe I could put like a stack of my coffee dyed paper or like I have some. Let me see what I have over here just to give you an example. Um Right now, I just have them wrapped around this, <laughs> uh, what do you call it, collage, not collage, but Franken paper that I was making. So I have some papers that I just had glued images to. Um, I have some of that. Um, I also have some things uh, like that I had played with. This was, I was playing with the Glimmer Mist. And then I, I had copied some this is a copy of one of my gift wrap that I have. I also scanned some fabrics and printed them. So I kind of have this random stuff in here and it's just been, you know, uh, kind of in this little folder. But now I can kind of organize it a little bit better. At least you can have five categories of them and they will fit really nicely in here because it is a uh, thicker, you know, even the, the paper size ones will fit, let's say in here, check it out. See, that is so cool. So I really love that. Definitely already. I have my $4 worth just in, um, these page protectors, almost like page protector bags, really. And the uh, glue sticks. Now, let me show you the glue sticks. I have a whole bunch. There's this whole package of 
uh, high temp glue sticks and most of them are the right ones. There are these in here also that I don't have that type of glue gun. So I don't know what, um, if I could use these in some way. Um, but in my mind is kind of trying to see how I might be able to use them. <laughs> but I can definitely use these. And I got all these of high temp. And then I have all these that are multi temp. So um, I don't know. These look a little bit more yellow. I don't know if that means anything. But in any case... I can use those. So that was in there. Another thing that was in there was this box of photo paper. That's awesome for printing things on. Now this is glossy photo paper. Not, not my favorite, but still it is, you know, nice quality paper. And I was thinking, I guess you could always print on the back too. Look, cause it doesn't have any, sometimes photo paper has like Kodak or whatever on the back, but this doesn't. So you could technically print on this side as well. But anyways, it's really shiny on one side. And um, as you saw, as I took these out, there's also these couple of papers in here, which are nice. Not very many, only like three sheets of this pretty paper, but I can definitely use that. As a matter of fact, look how pretty it looks folded for like for a journal. So that was pretty cool too. Definitely can use it. Then as you saw, there was this little uh, pouch, this little pencil case. And it's full of highlighters, markers, and some crayons. Uh, some of that I'll probably just uh, give to Lane, but the highlighters I can definitely use. So there's that, and the pouch is really cute. looks very sturdy. Okay. Then these two binders were in here, just uh, regular uh, school-type binders. Ugh, trying to get them in the frame here. Um, they're neat because they have this pocket on the like the front is clear but it's you could put a like a sheet if you wanted like the to, to put a kind of like a title page or something in here or it could just be storage so there's two of these are about an inch wide and one of them this one has these plastic tabs in it I love these tabs that have the pockets so that can definitely also be good for organizing so I'll probably end up using these binders with this um with these dividers or some other dividers that I have because I definitely have a lot of stuff that I can or that I need that needs to be organized let's put it that way okay so let me put that aside and grab some more stuff from in here there is also this is really cool it's four by six glossy digital photo paper but it comes in a format where you can print three pictures on it, and then you can pop them out. So they're like pre, um, pre-cut, pre basically, pre perforated, perforated, so you can cut out the picture. So if you print the four by six pictures on here, you can just pop them out. So that's kind of neat. Um, that's a good postcard size, I think. So there's that. And then there's a whole bunch of little things in here. So I definitely got my money's worth for the four bucks for sure. Okay, so there's this little Christmas pencil. That's really cute. That's like about a 50 cent worth pencil. There's this little journal, which is uh, about a, it's originally a dollar. It's brand new in the package. And check it out. It's got this little craft cover and the pages are this craft colored. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to take all the pages out. Like I'm going to take the spiral out of it. And I'm going to use this. This is a nice big tag. I think it might work in my um, altered book, actually. I might have to cut it down a little bit. But these, I love these papers. They're nice and sturdy, too. So definitely can use that. Then there is this card making kit. This is all complete. And it looks like it has a little owl, some bows. And there's a sample of how to use them there. But, you know, I can use the elements. Um, separately i don't have to use it with the cards oh, but it. it comes with cards and stuff i'm recording hon and then um he's fighting with the dog <laughs> okay this bookmark uh paper clip is really cute so there's that it's got like a little rubbery top on it and then look at this this is so cool it's a magnet butterflies oh, i want to open it though because I think what it is, is, oops, you stick it and then the wings should open, I think. Yeah, so you can open the wings. Isn't that pretty? 
And then it's a magnet here. So if you put it on your refrigerator or on anything, what do I have? That's metal right here that I can stick it to. There you go. See, it just sticks to the, that is so pretty. So I like that. Take it off my scissors for now. Put it on my ruler. <laughs> okay. This little fan is really cute. It's actually a nail file. So you can cut, I guess, take off the little pieces and use them. It's just pretty. That was from the butterfly. And check out these stickers. Got Barbie stickers. Got some Girl Scout stickers. Let me open this up. Well, I'm not going to open it up. It tells you the kind of stickers you get right there. So, I mean, they could definitely be used for other things other than Girl Scout. There's these cards. Where is it open? These are cute. These cards right here. Oh, they're different. They have they're already pre-scored right there. And look at these. These will make nice cards to stick on journals. Look at the mouse. <laughs> and the bunny. Cute. And then these envelopes. I don't think they necessarily go with the cards. It's got dinosaurs here. Oh, look how funny. <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, he was trying to cook some. Okay. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, and there's another one. Look at this. It's riding a triceratops. I think those are the only two. Okay. And then some more stickers, like little fish themes. This might actually work in my mermaid journal. And an address book. And it looks like it has never been used. It's a Hallmark one. $10 value. And... Yeah, there's nothing written in it. These are kind of cool pages, too, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this one. But it's cute. And that's it. Oh, wait a minute. No, 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 no. Look, then there's this bag. First of all, the organza bag is really cute. I can definitely reuse that. But look at the stuff inside. It's got these, um, it says they're stencils. For beads so I guess there's this product here that you can use to um, maybe applique on because it's doing it on a piece of fabric there on a tote and then these are little appliques that you can use um, not applique stencils that you can use to pour the beads in so I mean I could definitely use these as stencils as well uh, <clears throat> or even as embellishments themselves I think they're, they're foam Check it out. Flat back Swarovski crystals. That is amazing. I think that's worth the $4 by itself too. Super cool. Then, then there's this applique or iron-on uh, gems and these little soccer balls. So yeah, definitely I think I got my $4 worth in this bag. Super excited about those uh, <laughs> sheet protectors actually and all these little embellishment th embellishments and things are really really cool definitely things that i can use and i picked it up because of the glue sticks <laughs> so anyway which was your favorite item from this little haul what do you think i think i did pretty good for four bucks huh and um yeah that's it hope you liked it and i hope you have a blessed day <laughs> Bye bye